got to do more than manage our way through this crisis. Because long before the recession hit, many of our communities, including communities right here in Pennsylvania, were struggling even when the economy was doing relatively well. Plants were closing, jobs were leaving, especially in manufacturing. For too many families and communities, the recession wasn't a new challenge, it was, it's a permanent one. It's been going on for a decade or more. So in addition to dealing with the immediate crisis that we face today, we've got to face up to the challenges necessary to strengthen our economy for the long term. That's why I've taken on our broken health insurance system, so that families and businesses won't have to cope with double-digit premium increases year after year. That's why my Secretary of Education, Artie Duncan, is taking on our education system so that our kids can compete in the 21st century economy. And that's why we are working to upgrade America's most underappreciated asset, community colleges, just like this one. That's why we're doing everything we can to spur new industries like clean energy, to create good new jobs that won't be sent offshore. And that's why when the current emergency passes, I'm committed to bringing down the deficits that loom as a threat to our future economic growth. Now here's why we have to do all this. Because for decades, Washington avoided doing what was right in favor of doing what was easy. 